Okay, so for the head, we're going to start with the magic ring and then six single crochet into the magic ring. So I already did that. So now in our second row, we're going to increase every stitch around for a total of 12 stitches. Okay, so we're going to go into the next stitch. Okay, and increase. Okay, and also increase in the next stitch. Okay, increase. Okay, so you're going to continue increasing all the way to the end. Okay, so now in our third row, we're going to do single crochet, then increase, and we're going to repeat that all the way around for a total of 18 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, then increase in the next stitch. And then we're going to keep repeating that. So single crochet, increase. Okay, and continue repeating that all the way round. Okay, so now in our fourth row, we're going to do two single crochet, then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 24 stitches. Okay, so we're going to do single crochet, one, two, and then increase in the next stitch. Okay, and then you're going to keep repeating that. So two single crochets. and increase okay so continue repeating that all the way round okay so now in our fifth row we are going to do three single crochet then increase and repeat all around for a total of 30 stitches okay so we're going to do single crochet one two three and then increase and then repeat that again so three single crochets and increase okay so repeat that all the way to the end Okay, so after that now in the sixth row we are going to do four single crochet then increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 36 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two three four and then increase And then we're going to keep repeating that so four single crochet one two three four and then increase okay and continue one two three four and increase okay so continue all the way to the end okay so now in our seventh row uh, we're going to do five single crochet then increase and repeat all around for a total of 42 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two three four five and then increase and keep repeating that so single crochet one two three four five and 
two, three, four, five, and increase. Okay, so repeat that all the way to the end. Okay, so now after that, uh, for the next seven rows, which is from row eight until row 14, you're going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of uh, 42 stitches in each row. Okay, so I'll see you when you're done with the 14th row. So that we start the 15th row together. Okay, so now after the 14th row, this is how uh, our head should look like. So now in our 15th row, we're going to start decreasing and we're going to start by doing five single crochet, then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 36 stitches. Okay, so we're going to do single crochet. One, two, three, four, five, and then decrease. And then we're going to keep repeating that. So five single crochets. One, two, three, four, five, and then decrease. Okay. And then you're going to keep repeating that all the way to the end. Okay, so after that, now in our 16th row, uh, we're going to do four single crochet, then decrease and repeat all around for a total of 30 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, one, two, three, four, and then decrease. And then you're going to keep repeating that. So four single crochet. And then decrease. Okay, and then you're going to keep repeating that all the way to the end. Okay, so now in our 17th row, we're going to start by doing three single crochet, then decrease and repeat all around for a total of 24 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, one, two, three, and then decrease. And then we're going to keep repeating that. So three single crochet, one, two, three, and decrease. Okay, and then you're going to keep repeating that all the way to the end. Okay, so after that, now in our 18th row, we're going to do two single crochet, then decrease. And repeat all around for a total of 18 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two and then decrease and then we're going to keep repeating that so two single crochets and then decrease Okay, and then you're going to keep repeating that all the way to the end. Okay, so after that now in the last row of the body, which is row to, uh, 19, we are going to do single crochet, then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 12 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet and then decrease. And then you're going to keep repeating that. So single crochet decrease ok 
okay okay and then you're going to continue like that all the way to the end okay so after you're done with the 19th row now we're going to go into the next stitch and then you're going to slip stitch and then after that uh, I'm just going to cut my yarn and leave it long enough for sewing okay and then after you're done with that uh, you're going to stuff your head fully all the way to the end and then after that we're going to start making the ears okay so for the ears now we're going to start with the magic ring and then we're going to do four single crochets into the magic ring so we're going to do one two three and four okay and then after the four single crochet i'm just going to pull my yarn to close the gap okay so now for the second row uh we're going to do single crochet all the way around for a total of four single crochets so this will be a little bit hard to do because the stitches are quite tight but we'll see okay so we're going to go into the next stitch and do single crochet one so in the next stitch do another single crochet two and single crochet three okay and one more single crochet four okay so now after we're done with that uh, in the next row which is our third row uh, we're going to do single crochet then increase then single crochet and increase uh, for a total of six stitches okay so we're going to go into the next stitch and do single crochet Okay. And then we are going to increase in the next stitch. And then you're going to repeat that one more time. So single crochet and increase okay and then after that also in the third row we are going to repeat the same thing then you're going to repeat single crochet increase single crochet increase uh, three times for a total of nine stitches so we're going to do single crochet again and increase in the next stitch okay and then you're going to repeat that again two more times so after that now in our fourth row we're going to do uh, two single crochet then increase and repeat that uh, three times for a total of 12 stitches okay so we're going to do single crochet one and two 
and then you're going to increase Okay, and then you're going to repeat that again two more times so two single crochet increase and then two single crochet increase okay so after you're done with that now for the next two rows which is row five and row six you're going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of 12 stitches in each row okay so for the next two rows do single crochets and then we're going to do the seventh row together Okay, so after you're done with the sixth row, now in our seventh row, we're going to do single crochet, then decrease and repeat four times for a total of eight stitches. So we're going to do single crochet and then decrease. And then we're going to keep repeating that. So single crochet and decrease okay and then you're going to repeat that again two more times okay so now after the seventh row so we have two more rows left which is row eight and row nine and in our eighth row i'm going to remove my marker so we're going to crochet all the two sides together we're going to join them together so we're going to do four stitches to join the two sides together okay so i'm going to do one two three and four okay so i'm going to go into the first stitch and do single crochet okay and then next stitch also do another single crochet two okay join the other one two three and the last one Okay, so it's a little bit tight okay so one more time and do single crochet okay and then after that now in our last row we are going to fold again the ear into two like that okay so and then we fold it into two we are going to do two stitches okay or two single crochet so i'm going to go through the first stitch and the other one and do single crochet and do another single crochet the last one okay and this is how it's gonna look like our little ear so when you're done with that i'm just going to do a chain one and cut the yarn long enough for sewing okay so after that i'll show you how to make the hands okay so for the hands we're going to start to the magic ring and then six single crochets into the magic ring and then after that uh, in the second row we're going to increase every stitch around for a total of 12 stitches so i'm going to go into the next stitch and increase Okay, and then I'm going to increase in the next stitch also. Okay, so you're going to continue increasing. Okay, so increase all the way round. Okay, so after that now, in our third row, we're going to do single crochet in the next five stitches, then increase and we are going to do that two times okay so i'm going to go into the next stitch and do single crochet one two 
three, four, five, and increase. Okay, and then you're going to repeat that again one more time. So you're going to do five single crochet and then increase. Okay, so after that now in round four and five, you're going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of 14 stitches in each row. So I'll see you when you're done with the next two rows until row five so that we start the sixth row together. Okay, so now after the fifth row, this is how it's, it looks like. So now in our sixth row, we're going to do five single crochet, then decrease, and then we're going to do that two times. Okay, so we're going to do single crochet, one, two, three, four, five, and then decrease. Okay, and then you're going to repeat that again one more time. So five single crochet and then decrease. Okay, so after you're done with that, now for the next two rows, which is row 7 and row 8, we are going to do single crochet all the way around in each row uh, for a total of 12 stitches in each row. Okay, so do single crochet for the next two rows and then we start the ninth row together. Okay, so now in our ninth row, we are going to start by doing single crochet in the next five stitches. So we're going to do single crochet one, two, three, four, and five, and then decrease. Okay, and then after that you're going to do single crochet in the remaining five stitches so we'll have a total of 11 stitches okay so after that now in our tenth row we're going to start by doing single crochet in the next four stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two, three, and four, and then we're going to decrease. Okay, and then after that you're going to do single crochet in the remaining five stitches, so we'll have a total of ten stitches. Okay, so after you're done with that, now for the next uh, nine rows which is from row 11 until row 19 uh, we're going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of 10 stitches in each row okay but before you continue make sure you start here at the bottom okay so after you're done uh, your arm is gonna look something like this so you're just going to add nine more rows all the way around and then when you're done cut off your yarn and leave it long enough for sewing so i just stuffed it here at the bottom and then i didn't stuff the upper part uh, because that's how i like my arm to look like but you can stuff it a little bit if you want to so now after that uh we're going to start making the muzzle okay so for the muzzle we are going to start with the magic ring and then six single crochets into the magic ring and then after that, uh, in the second row, we are going to increase every stitch around for a total of 12 stitches. Okay, so we're going to go into the next stitch and increase. Okay, so increase also in the next stitch. Okay, so you're going to continue increasing all the way round. 
Okay, so after that now, uh, in our third row, we are going to do single, I mean in our third row, yes, we're going to do single crochet, then increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 18 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet and then increase in the next stitch. And then we're going to keep repeating that. So single crochet and increase. Okay, and keep repeating that all the way to the end. Okay, so after that, now for the next two rows, which is row four and row five, we are going to do single crochet all the way around in each row uh, for a total of 18 stitches in each row. Okay, so do single crochet for the next two rows and then after that I'll show you how to finish up. Okay, so when you're done with the fifth row, uh, this is how it should look like. So that is our last row. So to finish up, we're just going to go into the next stitch, then slip stitch. And then we're going to cut yarn long enough for sewing. Okay, and this is how it's gonna look like. Okay, so after that now we're going to start making the little red nose. Okay, so the nose is quite easy. It has only three rows. And in the first row, we start by doing the magic ring and four single crochets into the magic ring. So now in our second row, we're going to increase every stitch around for a total of eight stitches. So I'm just going to go into the next stitch and increase. Okay, and then also I'm going to go into the next stitch and increase. Okay, increase in the third stitch too. And increase in the last stitch. Okay, so after that now, in our third row, which is our last row, we are going to do two single crochet, then decrease, and we're going to do that two times. Okay, so I'm going to do single crochet, one, two, and single crochet, two, and then decrease. And then repeat that again. So two single crochet. And decrease. Okay, so then when you're done with that, I'm just going to go into the next stitch and slip stitch because that was our last row. And then I'm going to cut off my yarn a little bit long for sewing. Okay, so this little nose, we're gonna sew it over here uh, above the muzzle. Okay, so when we're done with that, I'm just going to explain to you how to make the horns. Okay, so now for the horns, I'm going to explain to you how to make them. So one horn has three parts. So we have one long part and two short ones. So the long part consists of 
uh, 11 rows of six single crochets so you're just going to start by doing the magic ring and six single crochet into the magic ring in the first row and you're going to continue and do single crochet all the way uh, for another 10 rows so making it a total of 11 rows so this is how it's gonna look like okay and then the two short the two short uh, horns over here it just consists of five rows of six single crochets so you start and do six single crochets into the magic ring and four more rows of single crochet all the way around okay so this horn uh, we're just going to attach it like that so it's attached two times so like that when we are touching it okay and then uh, when you're done making the horn so you make one two three this is one side and you make other three like this so one long and two short ones okay so after that I'm going to explain to you how to join all the parts together okay so guys as you can see I've already finished attaching the parts together okay sorry the white parts that you can see is a little fabric glue uh, fabric glue that I used to attach this uh, red nose over here okay so first of all for the horns what I did is uh, I attached one at the top and one at the bottom like that as you can see and then uh, before you attach the head first you attach the uh, arms first and they have to be in line with the legs like that and also on this other side and then after you attach the arms you're going to attach the head and then after you attach the head uh, you're going to attach the little nose over here so make sure it's a little uh, at the bottom so because if you attach it here at the middle it'll look a little bit awkward so that's why I attached it here at the bottom and then I also did my red nose after that and then after that I attached the horns in the uh, second chain from the hook second row from the hook and then going down and also on this other side and after that you attach the ears right below the horns okay so that's it guys and also my eyes you can see I attach them uh, right after the horns okay so but anyway uh, you have to make sure that all your parts are in line together okay and before you sew them uh, you have to make sure they are all I I mean they are fine or they look nice on the doll and for the little scarf over here I did a chain 35 and just one row of double crochet so and then I tied it here around the neck okay so guys I hope you enjoyed this pattern it's a very fun pattern to make so please if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe and also check out my other videos I um, upload one video every week until next time, bye.